What up? I'm TJ. Uh, pretty much the greatest fucking person ever. Ever. Evil. 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 The greatest fucking person you've ever fucking seen in your goddamn life. <laughs> Earlier today, I fucking, um, I uploaded a video to my Amazing Atheist channel. It was called something or another. It was called 58% of Americans are right. Because I think I did something that, like 32% of Americans are idiots or something like that back in the past over some other statistic. Um, so it was kind of like a, a let, let's be happy that we're right about something for once kind of thing. But in the video, I'm like, 58% believe this, and the other 43% believe that. And of course, there's not 43% left, there's 42. 42! And my math skill sucks, so of course I'm just like, 43 makes sense. One off, whatever. I just told people, like, I was going for the 101% because we're Americans, so we give 101%. Not like those other countries with their hundred percent. It's kind of like an, uh, you know, kind of like how every other country uses fucking the metric system and all. But we're like, <laughs> we don't need that shit. We got our feet and our fucking yards and uh, miles and all that. We don't need your meters and kilometers and centimeters and all your fucking meters, you fucking assholes. Then they, uh, you know, and then we have uh, Fahrenheit temperature, where freezing is 32 and boiling is I don't even fucking know. And I think that uh, in um, Celsius or centigrade, or whatever the fuck it's called, it, with the, whatever the rest of the world uses, the, the the freezing point is zero and the boiling point is 100. Is that correct? Because uh, that makes too much fucking sense, damn it. So just like those are American idiosyncrasies, 101% is an American idiosyncrasy. So that's what I was doing there. It wasn't just that I fucking am shit at math. It wasn't j well, not even math in general, just basic arithmetic is what really fucks me up. Like, just the, the, the it's really like that's my biggest challenge, my biggest hurdle, understanding complex operations is really not difficult for me, but quickly knowing like what 17 plus 22 is, all of a sudden they're like, fingers, fingers gotta come on my fingers because I can't figure it out in my head. <laughs> well, this the fucking dumbass. So I guess it's just like I have, I have trouble with, with basic arithmetic. But, um, but I have good math comprehension. Like, if I need to, to, to do, like, like when I took my um, ACTs back in the day, I did all right in math. You know, I had a decent enough score. I had a decent enough score when I took math tests in school, when I actually did take a test. Because usually I wouldn't take them, or I would just fucking, like, draw pictures on them. Because um, I was pretty anti-school. But, you know, like when I had to take like a standardized test or something, you know, I, I did pretty well. But, um, but that basic arithmetic fucking kills me. Because I just don't have that instinctual, like, sense of where they click together. You know, and I, 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 I sometimes I feel myself on the verge of it. Like, I'll study something, like, I'll just, I'll be doing math for a while in my head and I'll feel like I start to get on the verge of having that instinctual understanding and you know like when I was counting calories in my diet I could do the arithmetic quickly but then when I stopped counting calories because I'm a fat ass and it just became like too much of an embarrassment to fucking fail my calorie count every single fucking day that I just stopped doing it and then they went instantly back to shit. Like the next time I needed them, like a couple of weeks later, like my arithmetic skills, they were just gone again. So it's obvious that I'm just never going to have that going on. And it's sad because it's, it's, uh, it's a doorway to so many other things. 
And plus, you get some embarrassed. But at least I don't have to be as embarrassed as a friend of mine, former friend of mine, anyway. It was a former friend of mine. I won't bother to get into his identity. But there was an occasion where we were all sitting around. And someone jokingly said, like, yeah, like, 2 plus 2 equals 5. And he, like, this other friend emphatically agreed. Like, of course, 2 plus 2 equals 5. Like, real, like, snotty and sneering. And then we're like, uh, 2 plus 2 doesn't equal 5, it equals 4. And he's like, I'm just really embarrassed. And he ended up leaving shortly after that, um, in shame. So at least I, I'm not that bad. But, um, but yeah, I do suck at math. And I apologize for sucking at math. If you, uh, if you want to unsubscribe because of my mathematical, 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 if you want to subscribe, unsubscribe because of my math magical ineptitude, you should do so. Because I'm a failure. And I suck the fucking dick. Oh, yeah.